Welcome back to my channel, you guys. Today we are talking about some really classic pieces in fashion that never go out of style despite all of the changing trends because trends really do change so quickly. Fashion has been really fast paced, even luxury fashion. It's just the trends are coming really, really quickly and going quickly. These are classic pieces that always remain in style despite all the changing trends. Let's jump right in. So before we get into the classic items that will always remain classic despite the changing trends, I'd really like to thank my sponsor for today's video, Ana Luisa. So like trends that come and go, Ana Luisa believes in making timeless, affordable, and trendy jewelry that happens to be good for the environment, which you guys know I'm a huge fan of. I believe in sustainability. I will always choose the sustainable option if it's presented to me. What I really love is that their metals are recycled whenever possible and their gemstones are transparently sourced. I love the pieces that I chose from Ana Luisa so much. I love the combinations. I love stacking them. I love kind of like mixing it up. I like the stud with the dangly safety pin. That's such a cool trend that's happening. And I love that I can wear it with my double pierce kind of one into the other. And then I also really love just wearing it dangling down. I think that's such a cool look. I honestly want to get a couple more pieces just so I can add more of these little Ana Luisa earrings to my ear stack. I got so excited with these that I've been trying like 10 different combinations. I just love how each of them look. They all look so good together. So like I said, sustainability is so important. They're so eco-friendly, which just means so much to me. And the fact that their supply chains are super transparent is so important in today's world. I 100% thoroughly recommend Ana Luisa earrings. I love them. I've worked with them before. I cannot wait to explore some of their other jewelry on their website. Like for me, this is what really takes your look to the next level. This really elevates your outfit. Even if you're super casual, run day-to-day -day errands, if you're going out for a night on the town, like your jewelry really makes your outfit pop. And this just like adds a little touch of your own personality and your own self-expression. Now the best part of this is they are currently running the biggest sale of the year, 20% off the entire website. I will put a link and everything that I'm wearing in the description box below so you can shop the sale, check out all the beautiful pieces. Trust me, you won't be sorry. All right, jumping right in. So the first trend I wanna talk about today is the Burberry Trench. It does not get more classic and more iconic than this. The Burberry Trench is a staple. This has been a classic for so many years. This is something that so many fashion girls just covet. Whether you're into fashion or not, this is just a very coveted item. It's a beautiful piece that's always in fashion. I mean, the trench coat has been done by so many different fashion houses. I mean, there are so many different options of trench coats on the market but it's the Burberry trench. Burberry is truly the most iconic, most coveted, most fashionable, and definitely the most classic. Number two, let's talk shoes, the Manolo Blahniks. Now, these really were made super, super popular after that really famous episode from Sex in the City, where Carrie Bradshaw is getting held up in the streets of New York, and someone's holding a gun to her head, saying like, give me your Blahniks. Give me a bag. What? It, and your Manola Blahniks. What? That was such an iconic episode. That was so, so good. And it really put Manolo Blahnik into mainstream fashion popularity. Manolo Blahnik kind of went wild, so popular after that, pretty gangbusters. And it seemed like everyone wanted a pair of Manolos. They were like the shoe to have. And what's so great about Manolos is that they truly are a timeless shoe. I mean, this is a shoe that like, if you were in like the 1920s, I feel like this shoe would be in style and relevant in fashion. And yet here in 2021, 22, this shoe is iconic. It's classic. It's relevant in fashion. You can dress it up, dress it down. Like it's a versatile fashion piece. It's a classic piece. And it's something that's absolutely going to live on forever. The next item, number three, is one of the most iconic and quite possibly one of the most coveted items that I'm gonna mention here today. And that is gonna go to the Chanel tweed jacket. Now it does not matter what season you got your Chanel jacket because no matter what, this is iconic and this is going to be in style. The Chanel tweed jacket is one of the most popular, most coveted items in fashion today. It's a status symbol. It's a fashion piece. 
it's a serious investment. Serious. I mean, I've seen Chanel jackets for like 14, 15, up to like $22,000. And I'm sure there are some that are even more expensive than that. You know, I did a video talking about old money versus new money fashion and just like the differences between that like old generational wealth aesthetic versus kind of like that nouveau riche logo mania vibe that we're seeing a lot in fashion today. And the thing with the Chanel tweed jacket is that this goes back generations and generations. And this is something that was always fashionable and it's something that remains fashionable today. So it doesn't matter what socio-economical group you belong to, it doesn't matter what fashion aesthetic you love, like this is a fashion piece. And of course there are so many different Chanel style tweed jackets. I mean, you see them every season at Zara. Zara's always making like versions of this Chanel tweed aesthetic. So many companies are trying to get skin in the game because this is such a classic iconic look. It's been made classic and it's been made iconic by the house of Chanel. But at the end of the day, no matter what tweed jacket you're wearing, if it's not a Chanel, well, it's not a classic piece that will stay in fashion forever because it's something about that Chanel tweed that will absolutely live on forever. Number five is going to go to the Max Mara Icon Coat. Now, if you've been following me for a while, you've heard me talk about Max Mara many times. I'm a huge fan of Max Mara. I think they make beautiful, timeless pieces. The thing about a Max Mara coat is that this is something that will last forever, just like everything I'm mentioning here on this list today. A Max Mara coat is truly iconic and truly classic in fashion. I went to a Max Mara event once a couple years ago and I met the daughter, I think it was the granddaughter of Max Mara and she said something really, really special to me. She said that owning a Max Mara coat is just like owning an Hermes Birkin or Kelly because it's a fashion piece that never goes out of style. Like a Birkin or a Kelly never goes out of style. It's repeated every single season. I mean, it's not even seasonal. It's just, you know, Hermes has different colors, just like Max Mara. They make their icon coat and then they'll do variations of these coats and in different colors, more trendy colors, but it's the iconic icon coat by Max Mara that is a classic, that is a staple in fashion, very, very coveted. This is something that you'll see fashionistas wearing season after season because it never goes out of style. It's expensive and high value, but you kind of get the value out of it because it's something that you could just wear time and time again, year after year, season after season. So it really is a piece that is worth the money if you look at it that way, because it's something that you can really have in your closet for a lifetime. Number six, now you might not be able to have these for a lifetime because you know, the more you wear them, the more they wear out, but I have to give number six to a pair of jeans and it's gotta go to the Levi's 501. So look, these are jeans that are just absolutely so in fashion and iconic. These have been around since, I don't know, since I've been around, I feel like. I've always heard of Levi's 501 since I was a small child. These were like, you know, you'd see commercials in the 90s for like 501s and they're in style, they're still around. Now denim styles do come and go, but a pair of Levi's 501s are kind of like that denim style that, you know, it doesn't change. It's kind of like always looks, they always work. You know what I mean? Like a, a pair of 501s always work, you know? Even if baggy jeans are in style, if skinny jeans are in style, when you're rocking a pair of 501s, you still just look like you're in fashion. It's a pair of 501s, they're classic. It's almost like there's, no style to them, but yet so much style at the same time. Does that make sense? I don't know. Number seven, this is an interesting one. I really was, you know, questioning, should I put this on the list? But I thought, yeah, I should, because these really have transcended from era to era. And number seven is gonna go to the Ray-Ban wafer or wafer sunglasses. Look, these were, pretty big in the 90s, I think. These have been around, again, since I've been around, I think I remember these glasses growing up. And of course, they've been around for the last couple decades, we've been seeing people wearing them. So, you know, these, of course, go in waves of popularity, just like so many things, but they are classic. They are iconic to the Ray-Ban brand. And they are an item that doesn't really go out of style. I mean, it's like a basic pair, but it's a very recognizable and again, iconic pair. So it's something that, you know, you can have for a lifetime because it's like kind of that 
classic pair that you always have in your sunglasses collection. There are so many fashion icons that are seen photographed in these sunglasses today and even a decade ago. I mean, they've been so popular and they're, they're like a staple, they're cool and they're a good price point. So they're not that super, super luxury price point. They're kind of like that middle of the road. They're still often accompanied by really high fashion looks. I mean, if you look at Ray-Ban wafer street style looks, you're going to see so many high fashion looks paired with these sunglasses. So they really are a classic fashion piece and a great pair to have because sunglasses go in so many crazy waves of styles. I mean, there's so many out there styles with sunglasses. And you know, if you err more to the side of like a classic eyewear aesthetic, this is such a good pair to invest in because, well, it's not a huge investment, it's a really good price, and they're classic, they'll last forever. Number eight, and one of my favorites, I have to give it to classic Doc Martin boots. Yes, I love me a pair of Doc Martens. I've talked about them many times on this channel, I've styled them on this channel. I have a pair of black and I have a pair of white. I absolutely love these. I think they look so cool, so chic, so stylish, and again, just like the Ray-Bans, these are a pretty good price point. I mean, again, everything on this list can be considered pricey. A pair of Doc Martens are still, you know, about 150 to 200 bucks. That is pricey, that's not cheap, but it's a lot cheaper than a luxury pair of Valentino boots of the season, right? These are not seasonal. These are produced season after season. They're in style all the time and they're in style all season. You can definitely wear them even in summer with a pair of Daisy Duke jean shorts because that's how versatile they are. These are just a classic boot that will never go out of style. I've seen them done a really cool, super grungy, and I've seen them styled really cool and really, really high fashion. I mean, these boots are it, they are versatile, they are stylish, they are forever. Number nine, another pair of shoes, I gotta give it to the Chuck Taylors, the Converse, high or low, doesn't matter. I love a low, I love a high. These are so cool and everything I said about the Doc Martens applies to the Chuck Taylors. These are stylish, again, can be styled preppy, grungy, fashionable, trendy, like these are so versatile and it's a running shoe, they're comfortable. I mean, this is a classic that everybody needs. Everybody needs a pair of Converse. And actually, I take it back. I said that, you know, most things on this list are a little bit expensive. The Chuck Taylors are the cheapest, these are way cheaper than a pair of Nikes. These are cheaper than your average running shoes. It's a basic running shoe with a rubber sole, super affordable, super stylish, super classic. And finally, number 10, last but not least, I gotta give it to the Louis Vuitton Speedy. Controversial, yes. Controversial because a lot of people have an issue with the Speedy and look, I get it. It's kind of like it has that vibe or it has that reputation, I guess you could say, like the Louis Vuitton Neverfull. The Louis Vuitton Neverfull has kind of been deemed as a basic bag. It's kind of, you know, it kind of has a reputation of being a little basic. And the Speedy is kind of like right there behind the Neverfull, but I disagree. I disagree. I think the Speedy has more history to it. It has more age, more wisdom. The Speedy is not the Neverfull. You cannot compare the two. The Speedy is rich in history. This has been around for a long time. Comes in multiple different sizes, comes in different variations, different leathers and canvases. The Speedy is iconic and classic. You cannot put the Speedy with the Neverfull. I'm sorry. This can be so, so stylish, can also be very, very casual, worn in the most effortless of ways and also worn in the most high styled ways. I think the Louis Vuitton Speedy is truly a great bag to have. I think it's a great first bag to get because of the price point. Although again, this is not cheap. The Speedy is expensive. It's become even more expensive as of lately. I think it's had a couple price increases that kind of took it over a thousand bucks. It used to be like under a thousand, which is why it was so appealing to people. It's still in a cheaper price point compared to some of its luxury handbag counterparts, but it's still a really good price point when you're looking at a luxury handbag, especially one that's classic that lasts forever. Now, I don't own a lot of Louis Vuitton, and I, I don't know why. I, I like Louis Vuitton a lot. I love Louis Vuitton ready to wear. The handbags, I don't know, I just, I don't own, I think I have like maybe one, 
But I'll tell you, if I was to walk into Louis Vuitton today, I think that the bag that I would choose would be the Speedy. Based on everything that I mentioned here today, the price point, the fact that it's versatile, dress it up, dress it down, dress it high, dress it low, and of course, the fact that it will absolutely last forever and I can pass it down to my daughter one day. How good is that? Fashion mom being a true fashion mom. Am I right? All right, guys, that's all I have for you today. I really hope you enjoyed today's video. I really enjoyed making it for you. If you have any other classic items that you think I missed, please leave them in the comments below. You guys give me so much information and so much insight in the comments. I love hearing from you and I love seeing you and making these videos for you. And I cannot wait to do it again really soon. So until next time, bye for now.